rise and shine. Give God your glory, glory, rise, shine. Give God your glory, glory, rise, shine. Give God your glory, glory, glory to the Lord. What's going on, everybody? It's your favorite cousin, big cuz, big cuz live. Just want to come back with the wake up call. It's my wake up call. It's your wake up call. And guess what, y'all? It's time to wake up. So last night, you know what I'm saying? We were doing tall things. We were at the tall table discussing tall situations. And uh, today at the tall table talk, so make sure you go like the like page for tall table talk with teeth so you can stay in tune with all the tall situations. But I just want to run, the, run down some of the tall topics that we touched on. So first off, we got the Kyle Kaepernick situation where Nike, Nike threw him a deal. So we're going to see how this plays out because Nike is a major sponsor of uh, the NFL. Now, they're going to have uh, Kaepernick uh, uh, logos and ads inside the NFL situation, inside the building, on the way there. Um, just, just, I guess, there's another thing for people to be tall mad about. So, that also brought up the situation about, like, well, he's talking about, like, social issues, blah, 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 blah. So, what's up with Nike still being on the list, the human rights uh, watch list for all these uh, child labor uh violations so you know there's a lot of people tall talking um stock prices might be going up might be going down uh you could check them they were down yesterday but stocks go up and down and people just try to make stories about whatever so we'll see how that plays out over the next couple months who knows who knows what's going to happen uh next tall topic we got into is uh mgk versus eminem now eminem threw him kind of like a jab or whatever uh in one of his songs and then mgk went on like a five minute tirade and uh, definitely had bars for M. Definitely, uh, definitely was uh, hitting M. You know, uh, I, th I think he kept it. He kept it. Um, he kept it. He kept the hit decent. Um, MGK. My personal opinion is he had that. He had that. Uh, he had that response in the can. Like he had that in the tuck. He was ready to go with that one because he knew exactly what he was going to say. It was on point. Everything was on point. So I'm just saying. I think uh, MGK. Uh, definitely, definitely uh, put a fire um, on M. I don't know if M's going to respond. Um, knowing M, he will. And knowing M, he'll never let this go. Um, so we'll see how this plays out. And then your Catholic priests, your Catholic priests are back in the, uh, back in the news. And, and guess what they were doing? I'll let you guess what they were doing. Um, they're probably doing exactly what you thought they were doing. So, you know, shout out all the uh, people in all the Catholic schools and all this situation, man. The Catholic... The Catholic is really an institution, and uh, definitely in Philadelphia with the Archdiocese of Philadelphia, like it's big. Like there's a lot of schools, there's a lot of people involved. There's like we we're, we got like a cardinal. Um, and speaking of cardinals, the cardinal out of Chicago said something really crazy. He was like, um, "We got to stop focusing on all this uh, child abuse stuff and focus on things that matter, like uh, climate, like climate control and." Uh, what else did he say? Immigration. He said, that's what we need to be focusing on, immigration. I'm like, like he, this, this came out, that bull's in the mouth. I don't know. So definitely uh, definitely shout out the priests doing, like, whatever they're doing. You know? And then uh, Philly things to do coming up this weekend. You got the Fish Town Get Down coming up this weekend. And you also got the uh, PR Parade coming up at the end of the month. That's always a good time. Now, I've been working on these, uh, these wake-up calls. These wake-up calls are going to come back real heavy with these wake-up calls. So stay tuned. We got a wake-up call late days. I'm working on a story about how Facebook uh, Facebook Messenger just, or Facebook in general, Internet uh, kind of messes up relationships. And it's just deteriorating um, how people are, like, starving for intimacy because, really, you don't get intimate with uh, through Facebook Messenger. You got to, like, really learn how to reconnect. If you, if you feel like you're not connecting with people, like, through through a, a face like through a screen interface is really not the way to do it um so we're going to get into all that stuff um it breaks off into fomo and then we get to talk about some psychological stuff so that's pretty cool um got another tall talk uh topic for you like clubbing when you're 30 or over 30 so i think i'm over 30 uh physically mentally i don't know so you know it's kind of like uh when you're young you just want to be like shoulder to shoulder elbow to elbow with people just just raging in like some some crappy bar with cheap beer but now like you're older you know you, it, it's more the lounge type move where you like if you go out with somebody um you you want to hear what that person's saying and you want to not you know have people like rushing up on you and stuff so like that's definitely uh something to think about now the last one i'm gonna touch on we go keep it moving because it is the wake-up call it's my wake-up call your wake-up call it's the smells of the city um coming to work today like 
you smell everything. You smell the heat, you smell um, people on the streets, you smell good, you smell bad. And I just want to, I'll say something good that I smelled today. I was walking through underground. I usually don't, you don't always catch the best smells underground, but I smelled some lavender today. I don't know who, who was putting that good lavender out into the, uh, out into the ethers today on the ground on the uh, suburban station, but thank you. I appreciate you get the wake up call, uh, sunny other day. Um, just made that up. So we'll see if that, we'll see if that we'll keep that. Um, but yeah, it's your favorite cousin, big cuz check us out on the radio tonight. Uh, reef the lost cause. Um, Great MC, world traveler, um, real serious about his craft, uh, dope, equally serious about her craft. Uh, I'm the MC, um, so we'll see. We'll see what we got going on tonight on the radio. Tune in. I don't know if we're gonna go live. Uh, I doubt we're gonna go live, but tune in on the radio. If you're in Philadelphia, um, up to Cotman Ave, we get it, and then down to where the Phillies play, and then all West Philly gets us, and Camden gets us. 98.5, 7 o'clock, tune in. If you tune in right now, that's not us. That's not us. Don't tune in until set. Well, you can tune in now, but tune in at 7. All right, it's your favorite cousin, big cousin, big cousin live. Uh, my wake up call, your wake up call. Go wake up, y'all. Do 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 cool things, and uh, holla at your boy.